bit of an update. I'm going to go for the EX18 tomorrow, which is Residencia. Um, I just want to share these things so you can see the process that's going on. You can see that I did the Padron, uh, I did the EX15, which is the NIE, did the social security, social security number, and now we're on to the Residencia, which is the, the big one. Um, the reason I want to make this process obvious is to show that I've done it, but also so that you can see that you could do it. Um, the guide will actually have all these forms in for those that are interested in getting the guide off us just so that you can uh, copy um, the process. Because if you fill it in um, with your information, obviously don't say put my information, <laughs> you'll, you'll be able to go through the motions of exactly what I've done, but you don't need to translate anything, I've done it all for you. Um, and I will say, this is an important bit, if you do it right with the guide, you don't need a translator. The only people that will need a translator are those that don't feel comfortable doing it themselves. Now, the reason I state that is when I go to fill, uh, take this in, I don't just take that with me. I'll take my NIE. I'll take a passport copy. I'll take a copy of my tenancy agreement. I take all the documents that I need so that I can just go, here you go, so that the person behind the counter can go, click, 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 that's here, that's here, that's here. Yeah. There you go, stamp down, off you go. And that's what what counts, is being prepared for going in there. But where people hit a problem is, if you're not 100% what docu documents you need, and then somebody starts speaking to you in Spanish, because I know um, in Torvea, the they speak very a small amount of English. Um, not a big problem if it's all prepared, because they love it. Maybe if you prepare everything, everybody loves that. It doesn't matter what country you're in. If you've got 20 people turn up and they haven't got their paperwork, you're thinking this is going to take all day, and you're going through it, it's a nightmare. But if somebody turns up, that's what I want. It's in the right order. They're in. They're happy. They'll process it as quick as possible because they know you, you've done your job. You, you've actually prepared it properly for what they want. Um, and this is why the guide's important. Now, the other side has been: if you do struggle, uh, I will say we will help you. Um, now, if you email me and say, "Matt, I don't know what this word means," I'll explain it to you. But if you actually need somebody physically to go with you, I can organize that as well. But it's not going to be free. It's not going to be cheap. Um, you're looking at at least 40 euros. Um, it's, yeah, because you, you're looking because the problem is you've got the travel time and everything for people getting there. You're looking at at least 40 euros because you're not going to be in and out five minutes. If you were, not a problem. But you're generally not. You, you're keeping the guy hanging around because you're in a queue. Nothing we can do about that because people that do the translation don't work at the foreigners office. Um, so if you need it, it's there and there'll be a price that could be arranged for that. But if you can get away with doing it yourself, just buy the guide and do that yourself. Um, the, the difference between the two, um, doing these documents you're looking for somebody to do this. The EX18, the Residencia, costs 180 euros. That gives you an idea of how much people are charging. Now, if you buy the guide, which is only, I haven't even decided the price yet, but maybe uh, 10 euros, you've already got the money back. You'd have saved 170 euros just by doing that. Now, the other side of that being, even if you wanted somebody to do it for you and go with you, <coughs> if you bought the guide, then filled in all the paperwork yourself, got all the right paperwork in order, got everything ready for them, you're probably about to negotiate them down about 40 euros. Because um, they just need to go there in case there's any snagging, you know, where somebody says, can you give me a copy of this? Have you got your copy of your bank statements, for example? You may not understand what they're saying. But with this, most of it's done, um, so you shouldn't have too many problems, but that's why I recommend the guide. Um, because I've had time here to do all this, this is why 
I haven't bothered with paying somebody to do it because I've had the time to sit around and translate everything, research everything, where to get it from, speak to different people, and we'll go through the motions um, because I'm here. <laughs> I've got I've got another I've got enough time to do it, so why not? But anyway, just wanted to give you an update on this one. Um, I don't know if I've mentioned already, but I'm going to be doing the ones for the health cards next, and also how to get your kids into school. All right, thanks for watching.